Thank you for that moderating. We've got so many things. We've got lots of pieces here which will be great and I'm surprised how many we have got through in one session. It'll be really interesting to see what the next group come up with. And then on June the 4th, we're going to have someone come and speak to us about the SWANS evaluation part of the continuum and Patrick Griffin's work. And it'll also be an opportunity where you'll be able to see the cross-moderation in relation to what you moderated today. So that's part of what we're doing on June the 4th because we're actually a combined group on that day. But just in general, moderating and using the continuum, what new ideas have you found or what are the interesting things for you that you think are key for you to take back to your school? So shifts in thinking or benefits that you can see or how you're going with it? Some brave person. Oh, we've enjoyed, I, I know we've enjoyed actually looking at, uh, we've actually now in the three fours, done our moderating but then also taking samples from the ones and twos. Oh, okay. Yeah, kids and our bottom in kids and actually saying, all right, well, well what is, are we seeing alignment with those things? Yeah. So you're getting an increase across the school yep. in your understandings and in your discussion? Yeah. Thanks, Trevor. Other things that are coming out of it or that you think potentially will come out of? We've used it to guide our teaching. So yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So it's guiding teaching, and do you think it's helping us go deeper in the what to teach? Yeah. What is key? And we don't want to have a big list of, oh, I have to teach this and this as if it's a checklist, but what is key to know? And then our discussions about, well, how do we teach it? So it's a really important part of moderating. Yes. We looked at what what was missing, sort of like what we did today. Yes. And so we wrote on the top of it, oh, this child needs to, to work on adjectives and this child yeah. needs to work on paragraphing. This yeah. This child needs to work on editing skills. So it really gave me, as a teacher, because they were, they were my children, to yes. attend, direction about what, where to go to next for that particular child. Yeah. And that's a really important thing because what it is is giving specific direction for that individual student and it's not a deficit model, it's a, this is where the student is and here's what I will be doing to move them forward and de it's developmental. Yeah, it's a really good point. Thank you. Yes? Um, it's also very easy to use the continuum in that form mm. because it's, it's a lot easier to, than, than trying to work off what, we, what we've been previously. So this is yeah. much easier and it's, um, it's set out in a way that makes it very clear. Yes, so the horizontal format and the uh, and vertical down. form and the vertical yeah. format as well. So yeah. for me, the idea of having it on the wall and looking at, okay, well, they're here, then, you know, just, yes. just as a visual for me. Mm. Right, yeah. And as someone was saying to me, I think down at this table, actually being so much more conscious of going up and going down looking forward and looking back, which can only help us, can't it? Because we will have a range of students operating at a range of levels. Yeah, thanks for that. Any, any other insights before we finish off this morning? No? Well, thank you. You've, uh, the, the quality of the conversation as I've gone around the room has been fantastic. And thank you once again to those of you who provided these pieces. And we hope that it's been a positive experience, not a critical of look at this, look at that, but really how we're all going to move along. And the power of, in your teams back at school, working together as a team and working together as a school, but also the power of us being a group uh, working across Northern Region and having the shared understandings. And I know a couple of people have said, going around tables, great to be sitting with people from other schools and hearing their experiences. I know you said that to me this morning and hearing the perspectives and the ideas from other people at different schools is really important and part of what's being um, nurtured through doing it together. So thank you once again and we can break off and have our lunch. If you've got any 
pieces that you have moderated, if they could go into the tub here, and any bits of writing that you don't need, if you can put them back in the piles down the front, that'd be fantastic. So thank you. Thanks.